Hey down please, it's Dave Desai. Welcome back to my channel. Today I want to get into Taeyang and people talking about another career path they would be interested in seeing. And Taeyang has responded to this with some comments very recently. I wanted to get into what happened and what was going on. Jungkook also added a beard and long hair in the latest photo. It's hilarious. This is not of him, but we will get into it and talk about it. So grab your dumpling tea spilling mug merch and let's get into the tape. If you are new here and you're interested in this type of stuff, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and the notification bell to be notified and some new video drops. And if you're a hater, like to be the first to your hate comment, please make sure you hit the subscribe button and that notification bell also so you can be the first to do so. Now let's jump into it. The first thing I want to get into is Tang and some backstory on this. I just want to clarify if my videos aren't coming across clearly, I want to give some backstory on what is happening right now with Tang and how it applies to what is happening today. Like something that has come out a few days ago, I've gotten so many comments of people saying, why are you bringing up old stuff? The story relates to something that happened years ago. So in order to explain what has happened last week, I have to give backstory on something that happened years ago. But this is a new story. So if you aren't aware, Tang was an actor. I say was because he hasn't done any official acting since then, but he has been in music videos acting, and I definitely think he would be considered one of the lead actors in BTS, like one of the best ones. The other members are good, but acting is not everyone's forte. My daddies all have things they're good at. Jin, Tang, and Jungkook are probably the best actors in my opinion. So Taeyang in 2016 was in a TV show called Hua Rang. It was definitely a different time in BTS's career. It was a bit random in my opinion. I've seen photos of what people think is Taeyang showering, like that's a blessing. We don't get to see shirtless Tang much at all anymore, if that's actually him. But this was kind of V Daddy's acting debut, I believe so. I don't think he's done anything before this, and this really shows off his talents. K-pop idols, I think a lot of them like to do shows, as it widens their fan base. You might enjoy them on this show, and I think it's an emotional show, from the bits and pieces I've seen. You might end up falling in love with Tang's character. I mean, first off, get in line, okay? There's plenty of people in love. Tang's gotta make his way through all of us. You are not skipping me. I'm his husband, and I've never met him, so imagine how I feel. But if you do enjoy the show and decide to search Tang up, you might see all the music he does and decide to give it a chance. And everyone likes music, pop music is pretty much for anyone's taste, and then you'll buy a BTS album maybe. So it's a smart decision to have Tang on the show also in 2016, they weren't too big yet. So they were definitely still looking for more creative ways to expand their audience, also BTS's music is kind of like a movie. It has a story in there, and it's about triggering topics, the most beautiful moment in life thing. So a movie audience or a TV audience fits perfectly with the music audience. Now, there's a lot of armies or fans that want Taeyang to do more acting in the future. Perhaps be in another emotional show or maybe even a comedy. That would be cool. However, it definitely does not make sense for Taeyang to do anything like that right now as he has his mixtape and possible upcoming BTS album. If he spreads himself too thin, he could end up giving a very subpar performance in whatever TV show he's doing. But more importantly, he might end up giving a subpar effort to his mixtape and album. I just know he would be sad if his mixtape didn't come out exactly how he imagined it because he was focused on too many things. Now, during a recent interview, like a week or maybe a few weeks ago, Tang was doing his Weaver's Dream interview and basically all the members got to do it. And it's like this super fire rapid question and answer, almost like word association. So the producers will be like ARMY and then one of the members will reply my love or in Tang's case he replied whom I miss. They continued with a bunch of questions and one in particular they asked Tang that a lot of ARMYs were curious about, acting. ARMYs wanted to see if Tang would stop singing one day for acting and there's been a lot of theories online on whether he would do so or not one day. The producer said acting and Tang responded someday. That means someday that he'll go into IT full time. Now, I don't know how possible it is for him right now or in the future. I honestly think even after the military or after when he could stop performing as much, he won't give up music. I think he'll be a songwriter or something like that. I don't know if he'll step into acting again. I don't know, right? But I don't see it as something he is super passionate about. My other theory, since he has mentioned that an alternative career path for him was to be a farmer, I do see him as taking all the money he made and going off to a farm. But he is very smart for not shutting that down and being like, no. I think it's very smart for anyone to keep their options open and never say no. So if he does one day want to do it, for whatever reason, he still has the option. And since he said someday, he didn't potentially scare away any directors that might have considered him. Directors, please look this way. Tang is awesome sauce. And he would be the best actor in the world. Give him a lead role. How can you look at that face that Tang has and not want to see it on the big screen? The more I look at Tang's face, the more I fall in love. He literally has the most perfect face. From his jawline to eyes, nose, and mouth. I was seeing people on the tweets they're saying this. 
Really though, Tang legit has that actor voice. Like, boy, with more acting practice and exposure, he's sure to go far if he ever decides to go into that career. I really do hope he gives it a full shot and go for it full time at a later time. A lot of armies were crying and super excited for this possibility. I love movies and film, and they serve the same point that BTS has always been trying to do, which is tell a story through their music. Tang would be able to tell a story in a more direct way in a film. Now, songs are iconic, of course, and a lot of songs are remembered through generations, but films are what define the generation and the the culture at that time. So you can watch a film and see what people were thinking at the time it was made. This is why film, culture, and art is so important. I obviously want to see Tang being remembered in that way alongside with his music. He can even make an OST for whatever TV show he is a part of. Wow, imagine being so talented like Tayong. I would never talk. Just sing all the time. That talent also extends to various other members. I'm always surprised at just the amount of sheer talent that Jungkook has and the amount of stuff he can do. He he can literally do anything. He can cook and of course sing, dance, and act. But what people may not know is that he's a brilliant artist, like a painter or drawer. Imagine having more than one talent. Imagine having talent. But if you did not know, Jungkook did a little special sum sum for Jaehyun's birthday, which was a few days ago. It was hilarious and it was such a cute quote unquote prank. I think Jungkook sees all of the memes that we army send to BTS. Some things we should probably not send over, like maybe hide the things on the Wattpad stir. Let's not send them over there. Let's make sure they don't know that site exists because we will not be okay if they read those fanfics. Jungkook shared one of J-Hope's iconic photos, but instead of just reposting the photo for J-Hope's birthday, Jungkook posted the photo literally drawn in a sketch format. I don't know how he did it. It looks so good and so much like J-Hope. Like how is Cookie this talented? Like if he didn't want to do singing or dancing anymore, he could literally just be a painter and it would literally sell for millions. I think armies would buy every painting. Another thing that armies do is kind of funny is sometimes we will use slightly unflattering photos of BTS. Ones they have posted, of course and we will use them for memes. So Jungkook decided to make a slightly unflattering photo by taking this photo he drew and said that the photo was only step one. He wasn't done yet and decided to make Jacob into a little bit of a cute little meme. And he extended the hair and added a mustache or beard. It's the how hot J-Hope looks with longer hair and a beard for me. It looks so good. I honestly thought at first when I came across J-Hope's photo, I thought it was just a filter put on the original J-Hope photo, like one of those sketch filters. But this actually proves that it was hand drawn because you would then have to get J-Hope with long hair and a mustache to repose for that same photo to then put a filter over it. And honestly, I don't think they have the time to do that for a small joke. Armies, of course, died over this. I died. I was that army. It was really nice and I love this. I love how playful they are with each other. It's so cool to have people to love and support each other and also can make these super cute and funny jokes with each other. J-Hope did respond because this was on the Weaver stir, by the way. And J-Hope responded laughing with the backwards F. This is Korean similar to our LOL, I believe. I think it's the same. If I'm wrong, let me know. But I hope J-Hope had an amazing birthday and was able to really feel the love that his armies were sending over his way because he 100% deserves that. Let me know what you think. Let me know what your thoughts are. Leave it down in the comment section down below. Give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already and I'm featuring it in this comment right here. Thank you so much for your comments. And as always, I do have a Patreon if you want to go over there and check stuff out. I have a lot of videos over there that I can't really post on here. This is due to copyright or getting taken down, so I do keep it over there on my Patreon. You can get reaction videos like music video reactions, performance reactions, ship reactions. You can also recommend things you would like to see over there. Link is in the top of the description down below. Also, anything you contribute over there gives back to this channel. I have a video over there explaining that, which is free to watch. With that said, there's two videos that will appear up on screen at the end of this video, so click on one of those and I'll see you over there. Bye.